bombshell after bombshell. Anonymous source after anonymous source. You remember, you may not remember specifically, but you remember every day there was a bombshell and how, oh no, is it ever, is it, some of it looked bad. Some of it looked like the, the dam was breaking and all kinds of stuff. And they had nothing. It added up to nothing. And the over-the-top reaction to this is evidence that this is it. This is all they've got. This could be the straw that breaks the cattle back. They don't have anything else, and they don't have this. This is it. That doesn't mean they're going to stop. Don't misunderstand. But they don't have anything. And the reaction, the eagerness, the excitement. These people in the media, they have awakened every day, hoping and praying that this is the day that they get the scoop, that they find the dirt, that they unearth the evidence that Trump and Putin had dinner and put all of this together in a giant conspiratorial plan. They know it's there. They know it's there. And each one of them get up every day and tell themselves they're going to be the one to find it. And every day, nobody finds anything. It's gotten so bad, they have to make it up. Phony Trump dossier. They have to make it up. Like all of the leaks of all of the so-called classified information, the crimes that have occurred here have occurred and been committed by the people trying to take Trump down. Masking American citizens overheard in classified wiretap. After nine months, folks, they have nothing. Top reaction here illustrates that they don't have any evidence whatsoever of collusion or any other crimes. They're acting like it's all here. It's as they've gotten. This, in their minds, this is as close, they're so close they can taste it. They're so close they can see the trial in the Senate. They're so close they can see Trump announcing his resignation. They're dreaming about it. Some of them having nightmares, but they're dreaming, but they don't have it. None of it can be used in conjunction with this of evidence to which there is only one conclusion. They've got nothing. And that's or conspiracy. The most they can say is that this Trump Jr. was willing, he was willing to collude with the Russian to, He wasn't in the, he said he would take a meeting. Period. And that's it. If this is somehow a crime, then every politician and every campaign worker is going to have to do an FBI background check on everybody who writes them an email or who meets with them in their office. And adding to my theorem, he stained fingers by Dan Bowles of the Washington Post columnist, a revelation unlike any other in the Trump investigation. This column is actually what led me to see this frenzy, this, this email thing with Donald Trump Jr. See it the way I do. What is possible that the media sees this as their last gasp chance? Anything that even approaches the appearance of evidence they are doing their most. They're doing their best. They're doing everything they've got to make them this. I've been trying to do for the past nine months. I think it is crucially important that you never forget, other than the overall umbrella Trump colluded, but there's no evidence. None of what they've uncovered, none of what they've written about is wrapped up in this now. This is it. A revelation unlike any other in the Russia investigation is the headline. Mr. Balls, none with the power and explosiveness of the email chain involving Donald Trump Jr. that became Balls is actually admitting at all of previous revelations of amounted to zilch, zero, nada. Would any other, if this is the best they've got, and it doesn't even involve Trump. The emails between Trump's oldest son, the intermediary for the Russians, provide the clearest indication to date. The, in the mutual goal of taking down Hillary Clinton. So it's now a crime for someone in a campaign to even talk to somebody from a foreign country? Huh. Somebody better start prosecuting the Clintons. 
They've gotten campaign money from foreign governments like the Chai Coms. Remember the days of Charlie Tree and his little Chinese? No, in a barbecue restaurant. Charlie, are in donations. We all know this. Nobody cared. It was the Clinton. Have to take a break. And folks, let me tell you something. While all this is going on, there are people who have done what Trump Jr. is accused of, Republicans and Democrats who have met with the Russians about the election, about things in the campaign. Senator McCain is one of them. Using Trump and Donald Trump Jr. of, there are countless examples of Democrats actually doing it. The Rush Limbaugh radio program will continue. Rush being the left, coast to coast, on the EIP network. Shades and shutters from Blindster. Now, this is a company that's built their reputation on customer service and great products. And they're constantly introducing new designs to choose from. Includes it easy to measure and install everything yourself. Their fit or free guarantee on most products means that if your custom blinds don't fit, even if you blew it in making measurements, then you only pay shipping. Once installed, you have a 60-day satisfaction guarantee. Blindster is easy to remember. Blindster.com. Use the code RUSH at checkout. Save 40% on any order. Blindster.com. Welcome back. Rush Limbaugh, cutting edge. Societal evolution heading to the phones now. Uh, getting a little head.